It's wakey wakey time. Not that early. The pants first, remember? Pants first. In a way, I see family as the deepest of all subjects. The most intimate stories, because you're seeing people at home in settings that are as revealing as you could imagine. Over the years, family was obviously always in the background to all the stories I did in some way, but it didn't become the foreground until 2006, when I did the first story I ever did on a family. I mean, a family of a very strange sort, a family of religious zealots, extremists, if you like, in Kansas. That's quite nice. It says, rules that you should obey, from Noah Phelps, Roper, to Louis. Noah, who would have been probably seven, six, seven years old, from the Phelps family, Westboro Baptist Church. He made me this little booklet on how to conduct my life. Obey, obey. Don't kill people. Don't marry two people. Don't go to a fag church. Don't join the army or you will die. I had known about the Westboro Baptist Church going back years. It was founded by a man called Pastor Fred Phelps. They were famous for their pickets where they would wave very offensive homophobic placards and then they began picketing the funerals of soldiers killed in Iraq and Afghanistan. And the idea was that the soldiers' deaths were punishment for America's tolerance of homosexuality. And so based on that, we thought maybe there's a story here. I'm ashamed to be an American where the fags can freely roam. They spread their filth around this land. Every pervert calls it home. God hates the USA. Hi. Hi there. You must be Shirley. Yes. I'm Louis. Hi, Louis. How do you do? So, these are your signs. You've got God hates fags here. Uh-huh. And God hates you. Just don't think of fags as just those guys who are taking it up the tailpipe. Think of it as people who are involved in some perverted sex act. And I'm talking about anything other than one man, one woman in their marriage bed. Hi, guys. Hi. Hey, Hi. Put you, this is Gabriel. How do you do? 